What's up, JFam? How's it going? Um, very quickly, I just wanted to make a short video about Toon Link since I've been getting a lot of requests actually to redo my entire competitive guide, but I feel like the competitive guide covers most aspects about the character. So I very quickly just want to talk about certain strings and setups, I suppose, that you can do um, that will help you out. So a few little combos that you can do um, on fast fallers. One thing I really like to do as Toon Link is uh, I like to, right, because people are going to block when, when you're in the air because you could come down with forward air or down air or anything else of the sort. Especially if you have a bomb in your hand, people tend to block. So what I do is I like to throw the bomb up and then grab. And that's usually a pretty good uh, fast setup that people don't react to. Um, so what you can do is throw the bomb up, grab, pummel, pummel, back throw. And usually that timing is good enough that you'll hit your opponent into the bomb depending on, on how uh, far you are from the bomb. It's usually pretty reliable actually, um, at low percents, so, and at high percents. See that? Um, and if you do it really close, you can do pummel, pummel. Oh, I didn't throw it hard up. Actually, I hit up sooner, um, but you can do things like, uh, oops, bomb toss up. Well, Fox is just too close to me, so the bomb is actually hitting him. And then up throw for decent damage. But in any case, um, so this is just one of the many things you can do with Toon Link. Um, if people tend to block a lot against you, um, I talk about using Zare in my previous video. But another setup at low percent is boomerang into bomb into grab. And that's going to be a string right there. So at low percents, boomerang, bomb, oops. Even you can do boomerang, bomb, up tilt. And from there you can get some other strings going. So... You want to throw the boomerang first, and then you can go into your up tilt strings, into up smash eventually, depending on percentage. Oops, I didn't jump cancel toss it, but jump cancel tossing, all these things I made videos about, so if you don't, if you're unfamiliar on Toon Link's fundamentals, take a look in the description um, at my other videos that I've made, because I've covered Toon Link quite extensively. And you can get some big damage that way. Um, another cool string could be, and that could do for anywhere from 0 to 50 actually, on fast fallers. So Sheik and Fox are going to look to take big damage depending on their DI. Oh yeah, but that was off stage. But on stage, Fox has a, a bit of a harder time escaping that setup. If you want just the raw damage, you can just go into bomb into up smash, that's usually guaranteed. Uh, bomb into grab can also work at lower percents. So you have a lot of options here. Another thing I like to do um, is empty jump into up tilt. And this is strong because players will often wait until you hit their shield with something and then they'll try to shield grab you, right? So now what you do is you empty jump and since nothing hits their shield, they're then going to try to grab you. But what you're doing is you're going to empty jump and interrupt their grab with up tilts. And that's how you're going to get in and get your free um, early percent strings, basically. So, um, yeah, and this is pretty useful. Um, empty jump, up tilt. You want to make sure that you're facing your opponent when you up tilt so that the hitbox doesn't start from later and it starts from the front. And you get, you get to hit them before they grab you. You have to be very fast with this, but empty jump, grab. Uh, sorry, empty jump, uh, up tilts. Now, in cer against certain characters, um, especially fast fallers, around 40% is where you're going to be able to get up tilt into up airs. Uh, or I want to say 45 or so. See, that? that's a true string. There's nothing Fox can do about that. Um, even at 50, up tilt up air is true. 60% as well. And uh, as we get higher, it the confirms start stop working, but it's still pretty darn good, uh, even at mid percents. So even at 70 on... Alright, so now assuming Toon Link has no rage, if you have rage, it stops working. But at low percents, this is going to be true uh, when Toon Link is at low percents. 
double jump up air. So I'm doing up tilt, double jumping, and then up airing immediately. Now that's not going to work right there because that's too high. But at 80, when Toon Link has no rage, that will work. So that's uh, something to look into. But once your opponent starts nearing the 90% range anyway, that's when you're going to look for bomb toss into forward air to start netting your KOs. Um, so boomerang into bomb into fair also works. Very hard to set up in, a, in an actual match though, but um, it, it's true. But yeah, bomb toss into fair is going to be your, your good friend for scoring KOs. Uh, boomerang into fair as well is also going to work. So you're just hoping that they get hit by a straight hit. Another interesting setup you can do is boomerang, get behind them. Oops. I actually mistimed that. But uh, so one thing I like to do is throw the boomerang away from me and then run past them. And then they get hit by it into my up smash. But this isn't a guaranteed setup. But, you know, sometimes they'll grab you and then you can you can set that up somehow. But it, it does work. It can catch people off guard. Because uh, people forget that the boomerang is going to come back. And they're going to block or something. And then the boomerang will hit them. And then they will uh, they'll get up smashed. Zare into dash attack is also a guaranteed, uh, for racking up damage, uh, Zare into dash attack. That's usually guaranteed depending on the range that you do it in. But uh, it's pretty solid just for popping up your opponent in the air. You can't get any other follow-ups off of it. Another thing is uh, Zare into grab. And that's also a pretty good setup. Um... Yep, we're going down. <laughs> Alright, so um, yeah, so Zare into grab is also pretty strong. And it, you have to time it correctly, and they have to be at the right percent, but it's it's a good setup. Um, so another interesting setup is uh, when your opponent is at very high percent, right? Let's say they're at 130. So one thing I like to do is dash towards them, then roll behind them. Now, you probably think I'm going to grab them for the back throw, because that'll net me the kill. But a good opponent, as soon as you roll behind them, I'll even show it in a slower speed. As soon as you do this roll, they're going to roll over here. They're going to roll away from you, right? So you do this, they're going to roll away from you. But what I like to do is, um, for a kill setup, is I, I dash up to them, they're at the ledge. I roll behind them and then immediately I dash forward and I up smash because I'm anticipating that they're going to roll away because they don't want to get back thrown because I could just do that, right? But a good player, like I said, you roll behind them, they're going to roll away. So you roll and then you dash up and up smash and that's going to be your KO setup. Um, it's something that people don't... Um, it, it's just an... It's just a guess with Toon Link. Um, there's no real way to escape it aside from like jump away and air dodge, but it's a, it's a thing. Um, bomb toss into up air is also a very good kill setup if you can land it. See that? So Toon Link has a lot of setups that could um, net him some early KOs, and uh, I think they're worth looking looking into. Oops, I messed that up. Um, if you watch my video about Trump into up B, that's also a potential setup at certain percents. Oops, as I mess it up, but um, you get the picture. I made an entire video on that, so I'm not going to go too much into it. Um, another cool setup could be uh, if you want to fake out your opponent, because when Toon Link has a bomb in his hand, he can't swing his sword, right? He has to attack. So what you can do is throw your opponent off. Oops. Um... Alright, I don't want to kill him. Just want to knock him off. Alright, I'm totally messing that up. But my point being is you can use um, bomb juggle tricks into mind gaming your opponent. Into uh, thinking that you won't attack them off stage and then go off with a fair. So what I'm doing is I'm turning around and throwing the bomb, then recatching it with my forward air. And this is... Uh, it, it's not that useful, but you know it's just something to consider. Zare into the mist tech also. Uh, into an up smash is also great. And I think it starts knocking people down. Yeah, there we go. Above 120. Wait, did you see that? Is that the unteckable spin? I think so, guys. 
Did I discover something? That's the unteckable spin animation, it might be, which happens sometimes. So maybe you can do a Zare into up smash if they get the unteckable spin animation, which Fox is not doing. Yeah, I might have to test that out with another person, but that seems like a true thing. Um, and if so, that's really darn cool, and that gives Toon Link a lot more options. I wonder if Forward Tilt... No, Forward Tilt does not. Maybe Down Tilt might. But this is huge if this is actually a thing. Nope. If it is in fact unteckable. Uh, but in any case, I should not take up more of your time because I'm just testing stuff out for myself. Um, I didn't know that that was a thing. Oh yeah, look at that! He did it! But it the odds don't seem to be very good for that. But uh, yeah, if you down tilt at high percent and you see that torpedo animation, that should be a free kill, honestly. Because it is apparently unteckable. But it seems to be very specific. I haven't, oh, there we go. And that's the kill. Uh, but once again, this is, you know, neither here nor there. This is just options for you to know that might be possible um, with Toon Link. And that's basically it. Just fishing for back throws at the ledge is always a great KO opportunity. Reading a double jump if you can. Uh, and getting that up air, just like forward airs, of course. Boomerang into fair. Great option. Um, but yeah, that, that's, ba and of course an F smash from anywhere, uh, is gonna kill. F smash KOs so early, especially if you have rage. So just be aware of that, guys, and I think that's all I want to talk about so far with this. Um, you can always add in nair or back air into some of your strings, um, like up tilt into back air. Maybe look for a double or look for a down air. Uh, but yeah, that, that that's it for the most part. Um, up tilt into Nair. If you don't want to stay on anything, you can even get two Nair sometimes. But yeah, guys, um, thank you so much for watching. That's pretty much all I wanted to discuss. Just little touch-ups and little findings that I've had um, with my adventures as Toon Link. I'm looking to make him a solid secondary or main, whatever you would call it. So I've been using him a lot more and just looking to improve. Um, so if you have any tips, feel free to share them in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video and found it helpful, please give it a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate that. And yeah, share it and all that good stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Later.